Imagine yourself as a new caseworker about to respond to an allegation of child abuse. You take a deep breath and you get ready to knock on the door. You don't know what awaits you on the other side, but you know you'll have to make a decision that will have profound and lasting repercussions on the child's safety and well-being. Seriously? Again? What, what was it, two months since you people were here? Monica. No, I am sick of you people coming in our home thinking you can judge us. The power of virtual reality is that you're not just having people view a screen or watch an experience. They actually feel like they're going through it. They embody and take on the role of the character. So much so that through that experience, the learning levels increase tremendously. How did your daughter get the bruises? I don't know. I mean, she just came home from school with, I mean, We created a true-to-life environment with realistic characters and dialogue. We leveraged natural language processing to allow the user to choose from a variety of ways to make each inquiry and receive different levels of information based on how they phrase the question. Accused. So you mean accusations that were never prosecuted? It takes a long time to become a seasoned decision maker in child welfare years really of observing, inquiring, and interpreting human behavior so that you have a bank of information on which you can draw when you encounter new situations. Because of the educational possibilities associated with virtual reality, we at Accenture thought that it would be an extraordinary way to leverage this technology. Learning in VR is the next best thing to experiencing it in real life. This is a complicated world with many gray areas. There are no right answers. When you make a decision, you make it based on the information you have, and only in hindsight will you know if the decision was right or wrong. We must do everything we can to help our frontline staff become better decision makers. Come see how Accenture is working toward this goal by using virtual reality technology to keep kids safe.